Okay, so this is a follow-up. Now let's say I have the background, and for now we'll just say I'm sitting, and she's sitting in front of me just so I can show. And when I have the background here, I'm trying for the choke, and for some reason I can't get it, then now we're looking at combination attacks where I can follow up to something else. I'm underneath this arm, grabbing the wrist. So what I do is I take the opposite foot, right foot, put it on the mat, and I'm gonna slide out from under her like this, off to the side, and notice how she sort of just sat down and I'm no longer bearing her weight, all right? But I'm off at this angle now where I can hook the arm this way, inner elbow to inner elbow, and then I can push on her head. This leg is free now to step over her head, and then I can get an arm block. If she bends her arm to save it and joins hands and she's strong, then I pull this foot back and I insert my, my toes like that. <clears throat> then I let her head in and she sits up into me. And then I close up a triangle chip. All right, you okay? Yeah. All right. So we're back here again. Now let's say I have the back mount face down. So we're like this. Same deal. She traps my arm and rolls to the right. And here we are. That's okay. And now from here again, while we're face up, I'm going to put the opposite foot of the side I have the arm on the floor and slide my hip out like this. And I'm actually on my side. I'm not facing the sky anymore. I'm facing here. And this makes it easy to set my leg over. And then I squeeze my knees together and pop, I can break the arm. But if she's strong, then from here, I'll pull this foot back and I'll insert my toes like that. Then I can let her head back in. She turns into me. She might still have her hands together. That's fine. She gets up. As she gets up, notice my leg is over her shoulder, so I grab that shin, close up my triangle, and then I pull on the head as I squeeze my knees together. So what you got there is a way to follow up an attempted rear naked choke that just for whatever reason doesn't happen, and then you can arm lock and try to choke. So now we're evolving your training to where you're learning what we call a chain submissions, where you're much, a much more dangerous fighter on the ground when you can uh, follow up like a choke to an arm lock to a choke like this. And you want to sit up and make sure you hook her arm with your left. And now insert your left foot through the loop. And now she, let her head back in and sit up. As she sits up, she turns into you. This leg goes over the shoulder. So come on up, Katie. Immediately you grab that shin. Good. You gotta hook her arm. Now hook it. No, with your other arm. There you go. Well, this one should be out. Oh, right. There you go. Sorry. Okay. So then, and she's still, so then I let her. And then, 